Good evening everybody, Ryan Boudreau from AspenWeather.net. Just doing a little video here, I want to show everybody the new summer site, maybe get some new members. Uh, members we already have, you've probably already seen the sneak preview. Uh, we're going to get everything launched by June 1st, the new AspenWeather.net website, uh, the summer version. There's our new logo, uh, we had the snowflake in the winter so we changed that up. And, you know, we probably do more in the summer outside than we do in the winter, you know. So you need to know when that thunderstorm's coming, and uh, we could pinpoint that forecast for you. Uh, any outdoor plans if you are an AspenWeather.net uh, member. So I put in my own photos. Got a photo here of the airport. Just added this one, RVR down there, and nice little golf course. And um, there's Scotty taking us for a river ride. And, Put that in there that was kind of a cool pick my dog running in the water there maroon bells but um i love putting my own picks in there just keeping it real um weather there you go a thunderstorm prediction for the day that's one of our new maps um and it's pretty much a percentage map just letting you know generally what's going to happen throughout the day and right here on the bottom here noon to 3 p.m we got a 30 percent chance that was for today and then uh, 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., 60% chance, 20% chance from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. And, of course, this will become more active as we get into the summer months. But today we had an afternoon uh, pop-up, uh, not thunderstorm, but say a, a, just a light shower in the Aspen area. And it was quite heavy over there at T-Lazy 7 as it moved over the Maroon Bells area. So, uh, so that worked out. We had a 60% in there today, and we had one thunderstorm up here in Aspen. Now moving right along, so I don't want to bore you all tonight, outdoor index page. Um, so this pretty much tells you what's going on, how to plan your day, biking, fishing, golfing, rafting index, and uh, like I said, one through ten, two, you know, one through three being the worst, you probably want to change your plans, um, and we say that right there, one through three. It's a rainy, cold day, very cloudy, um, you know, windy, potentially, you want to change your plans for the day. Four through seven, it's a doable day. Like we like to do it here in Aspen. We like to get out there even though it's raining and thunderstorm storming. So the, the, the storms don't really slow us Aspenites down. But, you know, if you're a vacationer, you might want to know what's going on um, if you're planning a bike ride or a hike. So doable day, get out there, you know, you take a chance, whatever. But if, if you don't want to and you want to, you know, change your plans, maybe, maybe you want to do that. Uh, pretty great day, obviously, 8 through 10, and um, that's pretty much our outdoor index page for the day. I really like that one. That's kind of a cool one. And then your UV outlook page, and, you know, you've seen this many times, you know, between 1 and 10. 1 being, you probably don't need the sunblock. 10 meaning you're going to be fried if you don't put the sunblock on. So you pretty much, much get the gist of that. And uh, that's it, Aspen. I'm really happy to bring you the new summer site for AspenWeather.net. I'm Ryan Boudreau. Y'all have a good night.